Osher City Police say a nearly year old campaign to prevent car burglaries and catch the criminals who commit them is working. This comes as they arrest two teens accused in a string of burglaries in South Bossier. NBC 6's Jesse Kelly joins us now live in studio with more on this. Jesse? Well, Jackie, police say two teens broke into 17 cars and stole two firearms and valuable merchandise in several South Bossier neighborhoods. There was no breaking into. Uh, these guys were, were popping the handles of vehicles, trying to figure out which ones were open. Over the last month, Bossier City Police have been investigating a string of burglaries in the neighborhoods of Savannah Place, Shady Grove, Golden Meadows, and Northgate. They say it's important not to leave your belongings in plain sight. If you leave something of valuable value on your seat that you can see through the window, then that's a target for a criminal. The Bossier City Police Department wants to remind citizens about their lock campaign. Be sure to lock and secure all belongings, observe your surroundings, and call 911 if you see suspicious activity. We're approaching the anniversary of, of when everything began. And uh, right now, we're actually seeing results from that program. Landry says one year ago, Barksdale Airman Joshua Kidd was gunned down in front of his home in Bossier City by people trying to burglarize his car. She says that is what prompted Bossier City Police and the Sheriff's Department to create the lock campaign. Officer Landry says car burglaries are down 20% compared to this time last year. So we appreciate the community's help in getting those tips to us and having that video, offering it up to us for us to review and look at and use in our investigations. It is incredibly helpful. And the two teens were charged with multiple counts of simple burglary of vehicles and thefts of firearms. Jackie? Thank you very much, Jesse.